One of the most popular lights you can buy for YouTube videos or even video production are what is called paneled light. When these were first released, they were LEDs that gave you the ability to change the temperature of the light from cold to warm. Years later, RGB was added to these panels to bring in some colors and really give you the ability to vibe out your space with any color that you would like. However, you'd be limited with the amount of bulbs being used on the panel because they would have to be split by 50%. And that's why in this video, we'll be checking out this double-sided panel light from GVM called the 50SM. Because this one paneled light has two sides, it gives off double the brightness and is a feature rich light that truly allows you to use it in so many different ways and scenarios. And in this video, we're gonna be checking out all the details to see if this light is the perfect addition to your content creation needs. Let's go. You gotta just press record. Hey, what's up? It's Omar Tukori with Think Media and this video is sponsored by GVM and we just wanna thank GVM for sending out these lights for us to test and review. But before we get into the features and the things you get in the bag, I wanna break down different scenarios that you can use a light like this for just to get your creativity rolling and to see if you could potentially use the light in the same way. The first way you can use this light set is in a talking head situation and using one light as your key light and another light as your fill light. What's cool about these lights is they do include a softbox diffuse kind of like honeycomb thing, which gives you a nice kind of soft light on your face and it just makes it a little bit more flattering. And so it's really cool that these are included in the package when you buy them, but allowing you to use these as a key light for talking head videos or interviews and things like that. And using the second one as a fill light is one way you can use these lights. The next way you can use this light is to use it as a hair light or even a motivated light. Now a hair light is simply when you splash the light from behind you down on your hair and shoulders. This creates separation from your background and then creates just a nice dynamic image. This is a cool way to kind of bring a lamp from the back of your video, which gives the effect that a lamp would cast that light onto your shoulder or your hair. This technique is used a ton in commercials and in Hollywood, but is also a good look for YouTube videos as well. Another way you can use this light is kind of one of my favorite ways to use it, and that's simply to color your background. If you have a plain colored wall, whether it's white, or maybe you're using paper backdrop and it's gray, light gray, you can actually splash a color onto the background and create whatever color you want. And if you're doing this for your YouTube videos, that's cool, but you can also use it for thumbnails and create cool colors uh, with the use of a light. You don't have to buy or paint your walls. You could just simply use the different colors on the RGB side to produce whatever color you want. You can also use a light like this for accent lighting, which is a simply uh, splashing light in certain areas of your background. And we like doing this kind of behind uh, this like fake plant we have. We can just splash a light from underneath it. And it kind of just produces a cool vibe when we're shooting in the Kyle Anderson studios. But this is one way that you can use this light because it has so many colors and it's very powerful. You can actually produce whatever kind of light you want and splash it wherever you'd like to splash it. And then what's so cool about these lights is that they include the famous scenes that GVM includes into a lot of their lights, which is things like candle or TV or cop car or disco. The scene capability with these lights just allow you to level up the production value of a commercial or a music video uh, that you may be doing, or maybe you even shoot weddings. This is a light that can be really great for throwing onto the dance floor and things like that. Now let's talk about some more features of this light. As far as the build quality goes, these are made out of a durable aviation aluminum alloy material, which altogether just means that they're pretty uh, sturdy, that these could take a beating and they'll last a pretty long time. I love that this light has an OLED screen display uh, that's super clear, that shows uh, what the mode you're in is and the temperature of light that you're using, as well as the power from zero to 100. And also if you're tapping through the scenes and things like that, you can see what you're doing on the light. And even from a glance, you could see what mode your light is in, which is super helpful. There's two knobs at the bottom of the light that controls your brightness and also your color temperature and things like that. Um, but one of the knobs you actually click to tap through the different modes, um, whether that be the LED side, the RGB side, or the scenes. With the LED side of the panel, you have the ability to go from 3200 Kelvin to 5600 Kelvin, which is pretty standard for most lights like this. But again, like I mentioned in the intro of this video, is that you're getting the whole panel to be able to produce this light, which is super helpful and gives you essentially double the power than it would in the past. The RGB side of the lighting panel gives you a 360 degree color spectrum, allowing you to essentially choose any color you can possibly think of or imagine. 
The included barn doors you get with the light are super cool because you can actually change what side you have them on by simply uh, unscrewing and then flipping over and screwing it back on. This is super helpful to uh, direct the light you want to produce and so you don't get any spill when you're using the light. Another one of my favorite things about these lights is that it comes with an app and what's cool about this app unlike other GVM lights in the past is this app connects via Bluetooth so you don't have to like undo your Wi-Fi and then tap into this one and then try to go on Instagram and it's not working, but you can just connect via Bluetooth and control these lights wirelessly. If you put these lights in like slave mode, uh, you can truly uh, get the full spectrum of controls all from the palm of your hand using the app. Another cool thing about these lights is that they have the ability to add L series batteries. And so if you're run and gun and you don't have the ability to plug in, you could simply use L series batteries, which depending on the size uh, and quality you get, you can really run these lights for a long period of time without having to plug them in to power, which is super convenient and cool. Now let's break down what you get in the bag when you get the two pack 50 SM light from GVM. You're gonna get the two lights themselves, of course, two light stands for the lights to go on. You're gonna get a carrying case to carry all this stuff in it. <laughs> Freaking <laughs> frick, dude. Super sick carrying case. The two AC adapters to power up the lights. You're gonna get the two barn doors that you can use on either side of the light. And then you're gonna get the diffusers that you can add right on top of the lights with the two honeycombs so that if you really want that nice diffused spread out lighting, uh, that's gonna be really nice for using it as a key light. But that's all that you get in the pack of two. Now, as far as the price goes for the GVM 50 SM light, the two pack that I just mentioned and broke down comes in at around $700 at the time of shooting this video here in the US. And if you wanna get a three pack, you could save a little bit and it's gonna cost you just under $1,000 at the time of shooting this video. And you can check out updated links and more uh, about these lights down in the description below. I definitely think these lights are made for the person who needs all these features. I think you could definitely you know, save some money and get the one paneled version of these lights, but you're just gonna lose out on a little bit of power, which might be better for you. And we'll post the alternative uh, version of these lights, the one that had, just has one panel on them, down in the description below as well. But if you're definitely getting more serious in video production, maybe you're shooting weddings, uh, maybe you're, you're ju you just need things in your kit that can do it all. I think these lights can do it all. You can use them as key lights. You can vibe out an entire room because of how much uh, colored lighting they put out. They don't share 50% of the panel with LED bulbs, which other ones do in the past. And so I think for that reason, this is a super cool light. And I would prefer to have these around uh, more than the other ones simply because of the different use cases that we may need them in. And we're, you know, obviously we're producing videos at a high level and a high volume, but that would make sense for us but let me know down in the comments below what you think of that price point and what do you think about these lights just in general? Can you see yourself using these lights uh, in your YouTube video setup or maybe in what you're doing with video production? Would love to know down in the comments below. Now, if you wanna check out the video we did on how we use one light to kind of get different colored backgrounds, you can check that out by clicking or tapping the screen and I can't wait to see you in a future video. Peace.